the next few tournaments and then uh, have a good U.S. Open. That stayed in. 15 love. 15 love. This is the first game of the third set. Yeah. Good coverage, as you've been talking about, due to that wingspan. Clip the line, 40-30. Patrick, uh, we've also been... The guy's got a great serve, and every time I see him, he's got a little bit something new, but Can we seemed to work right there. Another ace. First game final. One set. game to love, Wheaton. See, Mary, his problem is he beats these guys and he loses to guys like me. <laughs> <laughs> You know what it is, Patrick, a lot of what it is with David Wheaton is he, he doesn't get bothered by pace the way a lot of guys do. He, he, he likes the pace. 30 all. He handles it here. Here it is. Here's that 360. <laughs> Everything's going his way. That's the second time he's hit that kind of a shot today. It's tremendous. Amazing. <laughs> Set the ball great off the ground. I mean, Andre was pounding uh -huh. the ball there. 30 love. Yeah, that's another one, baby. Two in a row. Now, that ball had to have come back as fast as that... Uh, 30 off. Uh, I was scheduled to have next week off, and uh, hopefully I'll just be real real prepared to uh, to play on... Uh, Mary Carrillo, joined by Todd Martin. <laughs> Terrific shot, and Agassi's got a couple of break points. For the first break chance of the third set. 15:40. Well, here uh, David uh, does absolutely everything perfect. He uh, he's, he shows some real good agility at the net. Uh, goes from sideline to sideline, and then uh, stings another good volley. But uh, Andre's always moving forward in that point, and uh, ends up being just uh, in the, in better position than David was. Still break point for Agassi. Is Andre, and everyone's watching. No, I don't think any more because of that. I think more because Andre's a talented player. I think he's a very good player. I don't think he has, I think, you know, I respect him. Late, Agassi has one win over Wheaton this year, but Wheaton has the head-to-head -head advantage, three to two, including that win at Wimbledon a couple of years ago. And, it's uh, not that big a surprise that this has gone to three, is it, Todd? 30 for done in a uh, Grand Slam tournament. He also beat Lendl there when Lendl was trying so desperately to win Wimbledon. <laughs> Perfect shot in this game to Agassi, four games to two now. I think, I, I certainly think so, but uh, you also have to take into consideration that uh, Kern really uh, being difficult to read where it's coming, and uh, uh, David mis misjudged it, and 30, instead of... He could use some cheap points now. He's two games from being out of the Canadian Open. That, that play is going to work a lot. It's that's the kick serve I was talking about earlier. Get these, uh, get the matches uh, through a little quicker. And uh, Cliff wants 15 seconds between points. No, How do you feel no, about no, that? No. Well, I think Cliff. That's what you said, uh, yeah, Cliff. No, no, no. I didn't. I, think didn't say I said that? that they should consider 15 seconds. Oh, I, I, don't, uh, I think maybe we should test that out on yeah. the senior tour. <laughs> <laughs> Touche. That goes wide. That nice goes wide play is. from David Wheaton. Zetas. Thank you, Cliff Drazo. 60 years ago, this gentleman next to me won the Wimbledon Championship with a forehand as big as Andre Agassi's, the great Fred Perry. Fred, how are you? Well, it was as noisy as Andre. So you were not tough spit on it, but uh, it was a different ball game when we played Vetus. We had the wooden rackets. There were certain things we couldn't do with the wooden racket that these boys can do with the new equipment. Uh, and there's no way that we, in our day, with the equipment we had, could play the way they do. They've learned to play with this new technology. Love They've it, learned it very well. They play extremely well. Make no mistake about that. But they couldn't play the type of game we did. They have to force the openings. Whereas we used to work for them. 
But I also know that one of the similarities between the, your and Andre Agassi's game is that you like to take the ball on the rise like he did also. Well, I took it as early as I could, yes. Well, I probably okay when they wanted to hit the ball to the backhand, I had to think. <laughs> but uh, I, 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 I played my whole game. Uh, during the sooner or later, they had to hit the ball somewhere short on the forehand. And, uh, when they did that, that was the end of the point, either for them or for me. You, you and, think uh, the equipment has made a huge change in the game? Oh, yes. No doubt. I think it's been wonderful for the women's game. I think it's it's made the women's game feasible and worth watching now. But I watch That's a lot funny. of it, and you, and you see some good strokes, which you never used to see with the, with the wooden racket. They've got the extra speed. I think there's too much speed here now. The ball is not on the racket long enough. They have to hit it so hard. And I find that most of them it's, they come from around the service line. Where they have to hit the ball so hard they can't get it up and down in time. Uh, and you don't see them working for the opening like we used to. Oh, listen, in Paris where they have to work for three days, you know. Fred, listen, great seeing you again. And back up to you, Cliff. And listen, by the way, Todd Martin, please keep your comments to the senior tour to yourself. <laughs> Wait till you're my age. We call it Jurassic Tennis, Todd. Well a done. love break. Coming for I, we're in store for a great finish. It's uh, The tennis is getting better and better as we go along. Fifteen low. Fifteen low. If the ball's to his forehand a bit more. He's given him uh, a few chances to hit backhands, and and David's come up with a good. So uh, if, if he can, he should start trying to direct a few more balls to his forehand side. The way things are going. Father Bruce. That wow, an ace from, that's number nine for Wheaton. Ball, David, this, this game. Oh, yeah. Maybe not. Sounds like the right idea, though. Almost took a bad bounce on David, and he had to adjust a little bit mid-swing. 30, 15. Yeah, I was going to say the same thing. Looked like he hit it a little late, actually. Yeah, he, three. The winners from Wheaton. Twice as many as Agus. Agassi holds on, and we are at five games all. Todd, you were asking. I think it, it's it's going to be good, and once everybody gets used to it, it, it won't bother anybody. Five games all. Fifteen love Wheaton. Fifteen. Eesh. That is very strong serving. Tenth ace. Thirty love. That's expected from him that uh, the ball's going to be coming back low, and uh, I think. Uh, when, when you're playing them, you get into the swing of things. Home. Game point. That's terrific serving Wheaton. from Wheaton. Problem for Agassi is he's going to have to hold on, and then if Wheaton serves that well in the Wheaton tie break. It's not easy to pick which way he's going, is it? No, he's got clean and as hard as almost everybody on the tour. Trying to get it in. Didn't take anything off that one, though. Yeah. Well, the one tiebreaker I played with Andre this year, I didn't win a point, so... Uh, that was... And then uh, Andre uh, hit four return winners and three service winners, so... Uh, Ooh, wow. Forehand winner for him there, and it's one point. You haven't seen too many errors in the last uh, three or four games. Two points to Two one, one Agassi. Agassi. Three one. Oh, that is a winning return of serve, and Agassi is very four much in Agassi. the driver's seat. Two big returns of serve. Four three Agassi. Well, he uh. 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 
It's a brilliant point by both guys. It really was that high backhand of Wheaton. A very Agassi. tough shot to make. Agassi stayed right in. In the tiebreak. <laughs> Trying for the drop volley and misses it. Wheaton's got a match. Six point. five Wheaton. That's team. great. It was a great serve from Wheaton down Six the forehand one. side and Agassi. <laughs> Ace. 7 6 Wheaton. 120 mile an hour ace and Wheaton's got another match point. That's only the third point Wheaton has won on serve. Agassi's only won two on serve, which says just how hard these guys are returning and challenging each other in this tiebreak. Another ace. <laughs> His fifth. Seven all. Wheaton looking at Richard Kaufman in the hope that he might get an overrule. No dice. Seven all. Typical showman status right there. He's not to be outdone. That one and just hooked it off the frame. That's uh, David, I think, just let the anxiety get to him a little bit and uh, didn't want to give Andre to hit the ball, give, give Andre a chance to hit the ball. Great return of serve, and David Wheaton steers it wide. That wasn't a bad little match. That was terrific. Absolutely terrific tennis all the way through.